Cut it into the slot. And then kick it out. McMenamin. McMenamin makes a move. Con continuing to put on some good pressure early in the game. Crespo off the glass right in front there. Get rid of that puck. Regula using the glass. Can't clear it out. Lampa from the Big Ten logo. Puts one holiday from Singleton. Goes by him. Penn State will cycle and change. Brick. And they're four and eight in those games, so the first goal is big. McEachern got a mini breakaway, trying to go to the backhand. Dobish not fooled. He covers that one up. McEachern, that was a great look there, Greg, but that touch, the puck kind of popped up. He had to you know, wait for that to get into his stick and allowed Ohio State to get back into the play. That was just talking about the importance of the first goal. McMenamin sent in McEachern. He did make a nice move to his backhand, but Dobesh closed the five hole there. But a great breakout pass. It gave him a go to open ice, and they use open ice when they have it. Sarlo puts one right into Yakak. Wall gets it out to McEachern. McEachern, his shot off Duke. He stayed with it, gets it to McMenamin. Peak on the special teams, that usually is, does not bode well. Now they're coming away with a shot here. That was off the body of Cam Feasing. But, but Christian we, we statistic-wise, something that you can kind of compare the power play to baseball as they play one in front there. Shoot, that's why they probably have a low power play total in terms of uh, scoring percent. Janiev had a look. Dobish saving himself. Gets to the right side just in time. They had to shoot that one. <laughs> it was a wide open chance. And it's out to center ice. Some good pressure by the Buckeyes, but it's taken over now by Tour Linden. First great looks of this second period. And here's a chance in front for Penn State. And a big save on Ashton Calder. That's the best. It up, and now it's Alex Savagno out to center with a good pass. And Penn State moving in. Calder with a shot. And a save by Dobesh. He sweeps it to the corner. That's the second good shot we've seen from Calder here. And the wing wide of the net by Kerwin. Good Puck movement there right out in front. Another save by Dobesh as before they get a shot on goal right now. Although they are getting chances. Here's a shot into the crease and a shot. That was blocked. Calder rebound, open net. And now it is Linden playing it back. They put it in front again. And there's that duo of transfers there. Linden and Calder from RPI North Dakota. What was a thriller of a game? Right out in front, nine minutes of overtime. And a save there by Dobesh. And actually, Michigan scored the apparent tying goal with three minutes left in that game. But it only kept it in, but it's intercepted by Kevin Wall. Wall got away from a check. It's a two-on-one. Wall looking for help. They're in too tight. They still get it on goal. And Dobish made the save on McKecker. That they didn't turn it over. Now they come up with inside it. the wall. Wall with a good shot. But Dobish turns it away. That was a big save by Dobish. In front wall, McMenamin. Looking for the rebound. Now it's out to DeNaples. DeNaples looking for that first goal. Instead, he finds the boards. And Dobish covers it up there. The Buckeyes escape. Finds a couple Buckeyes. And Matt Cassidy flips it back to Regulo. He's got to play it around. But Lampa's right there. And there it is. Lampa with a beautiful play. You're probably not going to score, but he gets it on goal. Here's a look at this. Look at this. Lampa and Kerwin. Finishes it off. That is very difficult to make that. That puck is coming in 100 miles an hour, and you've got to hit it right on the sweet spot to get it past the goalie. If you're even now, Kevin Wall looking to end the game. That one too strong. Lampa out to Kerwin again. Another shot. A little empty. There were great looks, and then there's nothing for Soulier to even touch. They were on the net every time they have 50 shots. And Kerwin, absolutely. Sooner or later, it's got to go in. Dobish turns away that Crespo drive. He's got the puck right now. He's trying to leave it down low for Servagno. Now in front, Dobish got to cover up. A couple good attempts for over 70, maybe 80. Yeah. Going hard for that century mark, believe it or not. And now Dobish didn't see that. He's got to go low at the last minute to keep this game going. Another split second. Save. That was behind him. He somehow... That was, Had he received that puck, he could have been in alone. Sulieris turned that away. Nonetheless, there's a low shot. Dobish gets it back to himself there.
I mean, they only like to get their shorthanded. They like to play with four guys out there. Setting it up, and there it is, Kevin Wall. To get into the slot, take a look at it. He's going wide there. You have another defenseman back. He doesn't have that opportunity, but that's what I said about not leaving someone alone in the slot. And of course, there's.